Hey everybody, Mungo Dark Matter here. Hey Mungo. Hey there, and today I thought I'd show you how to use a command block in Minecraft. So uh, let's get started. Okay, it's really pretty simple, uh, at least basically, although you can do some really complex uh, programs and circuits and such uh, with a command uh, block. Uh, but we need to get one first, and you can't get one in your inventory. You can only use them in creative mode, so you can go into creative mode and build a world and then go back into the world or have people go into that world in survival mode so so uh, the command blocks can do particular things in those worlds. And you've probably seen command blocks being used if you've been in various worlds in Minecraft. So um, they can be used on servers, and they can be used locally. But you have to go into creative mode to use them, or you have to be a server operator on a server to put one down. So the command to get one is give, and we're going to go at s for self, and then we're going to go uh, Minecraft colon, and then we're going to go command underscore block. And so here we have a uh, command block right here, and we can put it down. And uh, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, uh, put a switch on it by hitting shift, right-clicking, putting the switch down there. And uh, then we're going to right-click on the command block itself. And we're going to go say, hello world. All right, now, in order to activate it, we just have to hit this switch with the right button, and it says, hello, world. Every time we hit it, it says, hello, world. Now, that's a really simple command. Uh, it doesn't do that much, but a command block has the permissions to run any command. So if you create a command block and have a way to trigger it off, any user can trigger it off. Uh, for example, uh, let's put another command block down. We're going to put one over here, and we're going to put a, a switch on it, so so we have something to trigger it. And uh, we're going to click on the first one, and we're going to go time set the day. We're going to get done on that, and we're going to go to this one, and we're going to go time set tonight done with that I had to go back over to this one I made a mistake see right here we don't need this slash and the slash confuses it uh, you need the slash to bring up the command line when you run commands in Minecraft but you don't need it for the command block so done so if we click this one it changes um, the world tonight if we do this one it changes it today and so even if if you don't have permissions to do that, if one of these command blocks is set out, you can ch change the time of day. Uh, so that's just a couple things you can do. You can run any command with these. Uh, you can also uh, run a, a circuit. So let's get rid of this. And let's put down some redstone real quick. And if I put a pressure plate here I can go over this oh, let's change this back to say hello world Done. So if I go over here and I walk across this plate it says hello world so you can actually put pressure plates down in worlds or other sorts of triggers or switches and um, if a person walks over it it will will uh, send the message out so you can use that for building worlds as well so there's a couple of different things you can do with command blocks I'm Mungo Dark Matter and this has been Dark Matters and whatever you do enjoy playing Minecraft enjoy the day and I will see you soon don't forget to like Share and subscribe.